What's up guys, this is Angela Metal and I'm hanging here with the sleazy rockers that are Jack Viper. Hello. Hey, hey how you doing? What's up? <laughs> I'm pretty good, how about you guys? Yeah, pretty good. Pretty good. good. You're not tired? I mean, <laughs> come on, what a, what a cracking set that you just did. Thanks. Yeah, that was, that was cool. It was a bit close to the mark though, right? <laughs> Three minutes before you got, you're supposed yeah, to go two on. two minutes to spare, we, yeah. but we did the job, you know. It's cool. Cool. Yeah, it helps yeah. the adrenaline, you know. <laughs> the excitement. Yeah, yeah. Definitely, yeah. Rock and roll. That's what we usually plan for, you know, to arrive about two minutes before we go on, so. <laughs> That's a hell. <laughs> so for those who are new to Jack Viper at home, who are you and what do you do in the band? I'll take it away, Jay. Oh. Oh, okay. oh, I'm uh, JR, the uh, lead vocalist, <laughs> chief song, not songwriter, chief lyric writer, sleaze meister extreme. <laughs> modern day poet, eh? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. I'm Kiss, I play bass. Cool. Eddie Shredder, guitars. I'm the phalanger, I play the drums. Brilliant. Uh, so how did you, the band form? Oh, it's uh, basically, I think we all just got pissed off with uh, the, the sort of music scene in Britain and uh, just decided we wanted to take it back to the bands we love, like Motorhead and Guns N' Roses and stuff like that. Yeah. And at the time when we started, there didn't seem to be too many people doing that, so we thought, you know... And update it a bit for a new, yeah. for, for a new generation. You know, it's, we're not trying to reinvent the 80s, we want to make it, take the best of it and then make yeah, it like relevant to today. That kind of yeah. stuff as yeah. well, you know? Exactly. Yeah. Do you think that there's an uprise in that kind of music Oh yeah, now? it's definitely a revival. It seems to be a lot sure. more bands around. Yeah, in the last, last two, two years, it's been a noticeable Difference. Think, the scene Britain has grown. Well. Yeah. The scene yeah. that has taken off in Britain, yeah, time, which is really good. Who came up with the name? Can I ask? Uh, it's kind of a mutual decision, but you don't want to ask any more than that because we'll have to kill you. <laughs> Why? It's a band secret. I'll be nice. Come on, next question. <laughs> <laughs> no, come on, come on. No, sorry. It's a trademark secret. We don't. We don't tell anyone. Is it a private joke or something? It's very serious. Only one person has ever sussed it. Yeah, that, was in, that was in LA. <laughs> Funny enough. Okay. <laughs> yeah. All right. We killed them immediately. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, uh, you mean you're quite an 80s rock band, but have you got anything other than that? Have you got any hidden, you know, guilty pleasures, if you get what I mean? Guilty pleasures? Mm. <laughs> in the music. In the music. <laughs> oh, in the music, yeah. Uh, no, I'd say my music taste is impeccable, to be honest. You know, possibly the slightly embarrassing one's extreme, but that's it. <laughs> you know. <laughs> How about the rest of you? Um, probably Johnny, Johnny Cash would be mine, but he's like the he's a bit of a legend. He's like the country yeah. sleaze rock god, or was. Yeah. No, I don't think I've bought anything that was released in the 90s or 2000. Spice Girls, wasn't it? <laughs> <laughs> I can keep that quiet. I told you. <laughs> Go on. No, I'm pretty much the same. Maybe a slight prog rock, but that's as far Prog? <laughs> Dan, you're fired, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. <laughs> uh, your new um, release, uh, Devil May Care, uh, can you tell me a bit about that? Um, you know, writing, music, and so on. It's um, out, what is it, October the 1st? Yeah. You could be able to buy it from your local HMV. Um, iTunes, Whip It, 7 Digital, all the usual download sites. Yeah. I bet you wrote it at. Um, Doing a sound check at a biker gig. Yeah. Remember that? Yeah. 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 Right, yeah. <laughs> How can I forget? Yeah, listen to this riff. Yeah, that's cool, man. Yeah, that was cool, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Angel's gig. Yeah. Yes. Bulldog Bash. No, it no, wasn't. It's a normal. Yeah. Yeah. It's but, um, risky. Yeah. It's a, it's a it's song cool. for people who are just fucking uh, always whining and moaning and shit. And it's like nobody really cares, man. Just <laughs> suck it in and get on with your life. People you know? have compared it to, uh, what, like Volvo Revolver, Motorhead, and yeah. Guns N' Roses, that kind of sound? Yeah, so it's cool. A good single, yeah, I it's think. Like good reviews. <laughs> yeah. So yeah. Excellent reviews. Yeah. Uh, you've also done a music video for that. That's right. Yeah, yeah. sick. So have you got any stories to tell? Well, we did it in about two hours, I think. We've got it for free. And to be fair, I think it looks pretty good. Oh, the music video, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We filmed it at our uh, local rehearsal studio. As a fact. That's an exclusive, in fact. The, all the live footage in it is actual live footage yeah. taken from shows. Taken from shows. Yeah. And uh, yeah, it's a, good, a friend of ours, uh, the Serenator, who uh, um, directs it and takes our photos on the road. Came with us to the states and stuff he's like that. He's a bit that. of a mystery man. Not yeah, 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 he's a bit. He's a bit <laughs> he likes to keep himself himself. <laughs> but he nearly didn't get into the US. He had two minutes to spare to get on the plane. <laughs> we were waiting for the guy for two hours. He showed up. All good. <laughs> Brilliant. Um, you played at Crew Fest this year. How was that, guys? Oh, pretty awesome. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, pretty awesome. It was. It was just cool. Uh, sort of being in LA. Um, you know, meeting, you know, good people. Was it at the whiskey? Yeah, yeah the whiskey. Yeah. Yeah. Isn't that like your 
church of worship yeah. in a way. Yeah. Yeah. It's a legendary it's venue. A spiritual home of Sleety's Rock. So oh, it was pretty cool uh, to play that. And we were the uh, 